ओके गाइस इट्स मी इमाद फ्रॉम नेल्सन डार्विन पार्क टेक यूट्यूब चैनल इन दिस वीडियो ट्यूटोरियल वी विल लर्न अबाउट हाउ टू मेक ए हाफ वेव रेक्टिफायर विद इन द इजी ईडीए सो फॉर इट फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल यू मस्ट हैव टू राइट इजी ईडीए डॉट कॉम इन गूगल एंड देन यू कैन गेट दिस विंडो एंड यू कैन रन योर सर्किट online easily okay no need to install any sort of software or offline software you just need to come and simulate your circuit okay now we need to take our voltage source so this is our voltage source after it we need to zoom these things so that we can 100 and some like 200 okay we are going to Uh, make it a little bit like 200. Okay, so this is our DC power supply. We can change it to the AC by clicking on the sign. Now we can see the frequency as well as the amplitude. We also need to change the amplitude to one. Okay, then it's okay. Okay, now one hour s and okay. So this is our Sine wave or AC voltage source. Now we will take our diode, which will act as a half wave rectifier. So this is our uh, diode. You can take this and also change it to the 3D if you want. Okay. Okay. Click on the diode and then click here. Okay. Okay. Now we need to connect our voltage source to the diode. Okay now. Okay now we need to do one more thing, and that is that is to oscilloscope. Okay now, this is our load resistor. Why? Why we used to put it? Because when uh, diode used to conduct, uh, we 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 must have a certain load, okay, so that we we can take the voltage waveform across that load. Because diode will just get shorted, just get shorted with the what's called as the ground. So that's why we also need one ground, and then we will connect our ground with the. a uh, negative side of the sine wave or we can say to the lowest end okay is like this and now now we have two uh, terminals two type of terminal that is a and b so terminal 1 we will connect our terminal 1 with the what's called as the uh okay wait so can we connect it like um, okay wait we we need to make certain okay okay and it's uh, not going to connect why it is so i am not sure but now it is okay now it's working now we need to connect the second after the diode here and first with this ground and this with this and positive with the okay so one or end of the one side that is the side a of oscilloscope is connected with the positive side of the diode that is the anode side and negative on the uh, ground while b is connected with the like after the diode okay across the uh, resistor and after the diode so we will get our waveforms both input and output so now we need to save it out save okay we have saved it now we need to change our Transition dot run to it still it's okay. Okay, now you can see that we are having our 
web form now now you can see that the yellow web form is representing the prop which is attached to the direct source so our so from the direct source we are getting this yellow sine wave while after the diode uh, clipping of the what's called as inactive cycle we are getting this uh, blue dc pulse okay dc or we can say that it is called as the uh, pulsating dc or fluctuating dc but still it is dc because it do not use to change its direction while AC is what uh, while AC is changing its direction both having both the positive and negative cycle so in this way we are getting AC to DC or half wave and why it is called as half wave rectifier because you can see that this is one uh, cycle and one side of the cycle is totally uh, like a chopped off okay totally clipped out it's a totally off so that's why it is called as the half wave full cycle is from there 0 to 180 and then 270 to 360 but here it is just single cycle up to 90 sorry 80 180 and 180 to 360 there isn't any sort of cycle so hopefully you got the concept that how we can make a half wave rectifier within the easy EDM so don't forget to subscribe and thanks for visiting our channel